Hi, I'm Felicia Bonanno here today with Guest Active to offer you a full body yoga flow. This flow will connect your mind and body through breath and movement. All you'll need is an open heart, yourself, and a yoga mat. So let's get started. We're gonna start on our mats, standing in mountain pose. Ground down through your feet. Allow your shoulders to roll back, resting your arms alongside you. And then as your feet ground down into the earth, you're stretching long and reaching up through the crown to the sky reaching and extending in both directions, allowing your body to be long. And then place one hand on your belly, one hand on your heart. Take a deep breath in, fill up as much as possible. Feel that breath rise up through your chest. Hold it for a moment there, and then exhale, release. Take another deep breath in. Fill up as much as possible till there is no more space left. Hold it once you reach the top and then exhale, release, let it go. Beautiful, one more just like that, taking a deep breath in. And then this time when you exhale, you're gonna release with an audible sigh, letting it all go. Bring your hands to heart center. You can close your eyes here and just take a moment to set an intention for today's practice. What challenges are you expecting? What do you look to receive out of today's practice? What does your body need? And then as you're flowing, come back to this intention so that you can make sure you receive everything that you are worthy of receiving in this very moment. You're gonna reach your arms up to the sky as you inhale. Exhale, hinge at your hips, fold forward. You can bend your knees here. Grab opposite elbows and sway side to side. Clang your hands down. Hop your feet to the back of your mat. Lower down halfway, bending your elbows. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, we're gonna come into a tabletop position. Hands underneath our shoulders, knees underneath our hips. As you inhale, open up your heart, allow your chest to expand. Exhale, curl and round your spine, gazing towards your belly button. Inhale, continuing the breath with the movement. Exhale, moving as fast or slow as you need to. Just taking a moment to warm up our spine. Exhale. Inhale, and exhale. Come to a neutral spine here. Taking a moment to adjust. Planting your hands onto your mat. Bring your hips up high, coming into your downward facing dog. Bending each leg, pedal out your dog. Come up high onto the tippy toes. Swing your hips to the right. Swing your hips to the left. Gaze at the top of your mat. Bend your knees. Hop your feet to meet your hands. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, hinge at your hips, folding forward. You can always bend your knees here. Inhale, slowly rise all the way up and bend your arms, cactusing them out, opening up your chest. Extend your arms in front of you, hinge forward, folding. Inhale, half lift, plant your hands, hop your feet to the back of your mat, lower down halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. So this is sun A. Exhale, hips rise for downward facing dog. Come up high onto your toes, bend your knees, hop your feet forward, inhale. Exhale, hinging, folding, and inhale, rise all the way up, bend your arms, cactus them out. Inhale, exhale, fold, 
Releasing, letting go. Inhale. And then exhale, hop back. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise. One more, just like that. Clip high onto your toes, bend your knees. Hop forward, inhale. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, rise all the way up. And exhale, fold. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Beautiful. You can pedal out your dog here. Bring your right knee to your nose. Reach it back up. Right knee to left elbow. Reach and extend. Right knee to right elbow. Reach and extend. Knee to nose. Plant that foot in between your hands. Pivot the back heel down and rise up into your warrior one, bending in that front knee. Exhale, release. Release that foot back. Lower down halfway. Inhale, rise back up to your plank. Lower down halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise for downward facing dog. Left knee comes to nose. Inhale, reach back up to right elbow. Inhale to left elbow. And inhale it back up. Knee to nose, plant that foot in between your hands. Pivot the back heel down and rise up into your warrior one. Bending into that front knee. Release, folding forward. Lower down halfway. Inhale, lift up. Lower down halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise for downward facing dog. Come up high onto your toes. Bend your knees. Hop your feet to meet your hands. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, you're gonna sit down. Come into your chair pose. Pulling your core in, reaching and extending your arms alongside your ears. Sitting a little bit lower. Bring your hands to heart center. Twist, allowing your elbow to hook over the, to the right side. Come back through center and hook over to the left. Back through center and hinge at your hips, fold, and then release the bend in the knee. Inhale. Exhale, hop back. Upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise for downward facing dog. Right knee comes to nose. Inhale it back up. Knee to right elbow. Inhale it back up. Knee to left elbow. Inhale it back up. Knee to nose, plant that foot in between your hands. Pivot the back heel down and rise up to that warrior one. Standing nice and firm here, nice and strong. Bending into that front knee, squaring off your hips forward. Come into your warrior two. Making a straight line with your arms, gazing over those front fingertips. And then cartwheel your hands over and release that foot back. Lower down halfway. Inhale, lift up. Lower down halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise for downward facing dog. Left knee to nose, extend it up to the sky, to left elbow, extend it up, and to right elbow, extend it up. Bring your knee to your nose, plant that foot in between your hands, pivot the back heel down, and rise up for warrior one. Same thing that we did on the right side, 
we're doing it here on the left. Grounding down through both feet. Open up, T the arms, gazing over the front fingertips. And then cartwheel your hands. Release that foot back. Lower down halfway. Inhale. Lower down halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise for downward facing dog. You can pedal out your dog here. Taking a moment to connect to your breath. Come up high onto your toes. Bend your knees. Hop your feet to meet your hands. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold forward. And sit back into your chair pose as you rise up. Bring your hands down to heart center. Twist over to the right side. As you're doing this, you want your prayer to come towards your heart. Come back through center and then twist over to the left side. Come back through center, fold forward and release. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, plant your hands. Hop your feet back. Stay here in the plank pose for a moment. And we're just gonna shift over, balancing on our right hand, coming into a side plank. Release that hand down, shift over to the left side. And release. Lower down halfway, upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise for a downward facing dog. Inhale, reach your right leg up to the sky. Bend your knee, open up. Option here to flip your dog into your wild thing pose. So as you have your knee bent, you're opening up and flipping. Allow your chest to open up as you release your hand. Come back through center. Knee to nose. Inhale. Knee to right elbow. Inhale. Knee to left elbow with a twist. Inhale and back up. Knee to nose. Plant that foot in between your hands. Pivot the back heel down, rise up for warrior one. Tee the arms, open up for warrior two, gazing over the front fingertips. Come into your peaceful warrior. Tee the arms again. Pull yourself forward, straighten that front leg, come into your triangle pose. From here, you're gonna plant your right hand down, grounding down to your right hand, right foot coming into the half moon balancing pose. So you're imagining your foot is pressing up against the wall. And then you're slowly going to shift so that the toes are pointing down towards the ground. You can bend your balancing leg a little bit, the knee. Bring your hands to heart center and rise up into warrior three. Release that foot back. 
open up for a bend and then fold forward planting your hands down inhale upward facing dog exhale hips rise for downward facing dog left leg rises up high to the sky bend the knee open up you can do wild thing here if it's in your practice And then come back through center. Knee to nose. Inhale. Knee to left elbow. Inhale. Knee to right elbow. Inhale. Knee to nose again. Plant the foot in between your hands. Pivot the back heel down and rise up for warrior one. Grounding down through both feet here. Open up to warrior two, easing over the front fingertips. Coming into that peaceful warrior. Coming back into warrior two, straighten the front leg as you pull yourself forward, coming into triangle pose. Gazing up towards the top fingertips. Ground down through the bottom hand and foot, coming into the half moon balancing pose here. And then square out your hips, gaze down towards your mat. You can bend the balancing leg, bring your hands to heart center, and then come into your warrior three. Release the foot down, gently to the mat. Open up, and fold forward hinging. Release that foot back. Stay in your plank pose for a moment. Offering up side plank on the right side. And then switching over to the left. Lower down halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise for downward facing dog. Taking a moment to connect to your breath, pulling your hips up high to the sky, grounding down through your hands and your feet. Inhale, reach your right leg up to the sky, bend your knee, open up, knee to nose, inhale. Right elbow, inhale. Left elbow, inhale it up. Knee to nose, plant the foot down, warrior one. Open up to warrior two. Peaceful warrior. Straighten the front knee, pull yourself forward for triangle pose. Coming into that standing, half moon balance. Come into your warrior three. Inhale. Exhale, release back down to your mat. Upward facing dog. Exhale, hips rise for downward facing dog. Left leg rises up high to the sky, open up. Knee to nose, inhale. Knee to left elbow, inhale. Knee to left elbow, inhale. Knee to nose, plant the foot down, pivot the back heel down, rise up to warrior one. Open up to warrior two, peaceful warrior. Straighten the front knee, come into that triangle pose. 
Ground down for the half moon balance. And then pivot for warrior three. And release. Coming into that plank pose. Stay here for a moment, breathing. Pulling that core in, pushing the mat, pushing the ground away from you. While staying grounded at the same time. Side plank on the right side. And then on the left. Right side again. And on the left. Beautiful. I hope you are feeling nice and warm because I sure am. Coming back into that downward facing dog. We're gonna do one more time on each side. Right leg rises up high. Knee to nose, plant that foot in between the hands. Rise up to warrior one. Open up to warrior two. Peaceful warrior, triangle pose. Standing balance, half moon, then come into your warrior three. Release, and fold for connecting back to the mat. And then the left side, left leg rises up high, knee to nose, plant the foot in between your hands, pivot the back, heel down, rise up, open up to warrior two, peaceful warrior, triangle pose, and then your half moon standing balance. And warrior three. And open up to release. Upward facing dog. Inhale, downward facing dog. Come back into your plank pose. Side plank on the right side. And on the left. On the right. And on the left. Bring your knees down to the mat. Sit back onto your heels, open up your chest, reach your hands above. And going in circles in one direction and then going in circles in the opposite direction. Place your hands on your knees, roll your shoulders back and then roll them forward. Releasing any pent up tension. Come up onto your knees. Allow your hands to come on your lower back. And then open up your chest, coming into your camel pose. You can release the right hand down to the right heel. Open up through the left side body. Round your body forward, sitting onto your heels. And then open up to the other side. And then continue with the breath, adding in the movements, allowing your body to be fluid as it opens up. And then you can come back to your heels, swing your feet forward in front of you. Bring the sole of your right foot to meet your thigh. 
And you're gonna fold forward over that extended left leg. Rise all the way back up, switch legs. Folding forward over the straight leg. And rise all the way back up. Extend both legs in front of you. And here there's no agenda, just fold forward, not forcing anything, just allow your hips to hinge. And allow gravity to take hold of you. Slowly sit back up, coming into our boat pose bringing the legs parallel to the ground, extending our arms with the legs. Holding here for five, four, three, open up through your chest, up nice and tall, two, one. Release your feet down, cross your knees, do a little lift, release, and come right back in for five. Four, three, two, one. Amazing. One more time, crossing at the legs. Lift and come back up into that boat pose. You got it. This is the last one for five. Roll your shoulders back. Four, allow your chest to open up. Three, two, one, amazing. Slowly release down onto your mat. Lift your legs up high to the sky. And we're gonna do our shoulder stand. So for here, you're gonna lift your hips up high. Use your hands to support your lower back. And create that straight line with your legs. Hinging at your hips, you can slowly come into plow pose, interlocking your hands behind you, or you can stay right in the shoulder stand. Ground down your hands onto your mat and slowly lower down one vertebrae at a time, allowing your feet to be the last thing to reach the mat. Inhale, lift your legs up, and you can stay right here, or see if you can roll them forward, coming back into that plow pose, and then slowly lowering down onto the mat with control. Inhale. And exhale. One more, inhale, and exhale. Allow your chest to open up. You're gonna pull your chest forward, allow your forearms to come onto the mat, coming into fish pose. Taking a moment to breathe here as you open up your chest, open up your neck, Open up your back. And then release onto the mat. Bring your knees into your chest. Give yourself a hug. Rest your knees onto the mat. Inhale, lift your hips up high. Exhale, release. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, release. Inhale, lift. Exhale, release. This time we're gonna reach up our left leg. So inhale, lifting up our hips, extending the left leg. 
Lower down the hips. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale, release. Opposite side. Inhale, reach and extend the right leg. Release the hips down. Inhale. Continuing the movement with the breath. And then release. Allowing the soles of the feet to meet the mat. We're gonna allow the foot of our right, her right foot to connect to the left knee. Coming into a figure four position here for a recline pigeon pose. Then we're gonna pull that left leg in towards us as we push that right knee away from us to open up the hips. Go as far as you need to here. Listen to your body with the movement. And then release down to the mat. Do the opposite side. You might find that different sides of your body have different things going on. So honor your body. No matter what it's going through, where you are at, you only get one body, so it's important that you listen to it, that you care for it with love and respect always. Trust me. <laughs> and then release down onto the mat. Bring your knees into your chest. Give yourself a hug here. And then rock and roll. Come up to a comfortable seat. And we're gonna finish just as we started. Place one hand on your belly, one hand on your heart. You can close your eyes here for a moment, taking a deep breath in, filling up all the way, and then exhale, release. Inhale. Feel the breath rise up through your heart, through your chest, and then exhale, release, let it all go. One more deep breath in, fill up with as much air as possible till there is no space left. Feel your heart expand and open up. Hold it for a moment at the top, and then with an audible sigh, release and let it all go. Bring your hands to heart center, bowing down in gratitude to yourself for this time that you devoted to your body with love and honoring all of those that shared this practice, this moment of energy with us. The light and love within me honors and recognizes the light and love within each and every one of you. Namaste. And thank you so, so much. I love practicing with you.